dollars for my car, for my bike, for everything. Just a few more dollars, dollars. A warm welcome from the southeast England. You're on just a few dollars with Michael. We've got poor conditions in the yard, but we've got to go on. It's wet as. As I said, it's a sad and sorry sight when a car meets its fate. No one loves it anymore. And have a look what happens here. Cle Aye. <laughs> That's clever Trevor up there, look at that. He's under there. We don't know what he's doing. <laughs> what a laugh, huh? Now here's uh, an XJ Jag, so this is a B12, and you think any parts get pulled off it? Blinkers, uh, mirrors, windscreen surrounds, anything, even the engine's in it, and it's scrap. So uh, this place is not for the faint-hearted. You know, there's a lot of accident cars there over in the back in the rack, and uh, here's the B12 engine here. So, I was wrong about this Jaguar. Clever Trevor has put it aside because Clever Trevor races a V12 Jaguar. So he wants it, this as a spare engine. That's it there. Pull this engine out and on the side and he can take it home. Good outcome. Uh, hey mate, I'll have a uh, bacon and sausage roll with red. And uh, a regular latte, please. Yeah, how much is that? Uh, so she's making rolls, reg uh, regular latte is three fish and five. Yeah. This morning's work is this grab tips. Of course, e expert Andy, expert Andy. Yeah, we can get that moved. Yeah, that's all right. And here we have the tips. See here, they should come to a point. Sorry, they should come to a point like that. So therefore, we're gonna weld on them. See how we go. Right, the filling and the shaping's done. There it is there, I'll show you the side profile. See? And what we're going to do is just going to coat the tip underneath and main on the side, but mainly on the outside. That's where it drags along the ground when they sweep the floor and pick things up. It wears there. So now we have to change the wire in the machine. And here we have a machine, it's called Megatronic, made in Denmark. Not cheap, these machines, right? But we're, it's one millimetre wire. There it says 600. So the 600 represents the composition, composition of the hard face. And uh, it's a, so it has nickels and chrome in it for wear resistance. Like it? Oh yeah! Yeah! Come on! Subscribe!
Right, this machine here, this is a basic yard welder. I think it's called the Yard 300, Omega 300 Megatronic. It's got your digital display. We've got the volts here and the Wi-Fi. And then after you start welding, it tells you how many, how many amps, how many amps you're drawing. And there it is there, in all of its glory. So not cheap, but quality. And I've just installed the hard face. We ride on it HF so we don't get it mixed up. It's one millimeter, so it uses the same rollers. And there's the wire coming through, and you push it in here. These are just quick release drivers, snap them in, and then we've got a button up here to turn it. Watch this. Aha. See? And then we refeed the wire through. It's skippy here, a uh, bit overcast, but very pleasant. Nice temperature, about 10 degrees. And uh, this is not a scrapyard challenge, but we don't have the privilege of buying new tips. Now normally if you buy a new tip, you slice it off here where the old tip is joined. You cut it under here, slice it up under there where the weld is, and you put a new one on. Unfortunately, we don't have that privilege. So what I'm doing as a welder, a fitter welder, I'm building this up, see? See, it's all gone, see, it's all gone, it should be, it should be sort of like in that shape there. You get what I mean? You're starting to really understand everything in the nuts and cruts about engineering. He's hiding, there he is, there's little Stuart. I think I'm finished welding the tip here. Let's have a closer look. Yeah, it's in focus. There we have the finished product. This is hard face, and uh, there we got a whole new shape. See the shape now? So hopefully uh, that should do. And that's all from uh, Saturday morning. That's in Skippy Land. It's not about a class act, you know. I had that in the previous episode, but I think I'm just about to grind this too. I'm just about to grind it and shape it. I think. This is about having a high degree of versatility. Fix the Rolls Royce. Fix the forklift, the generator, the lorries, the grabs, grab tips, sweep the floor, answer questions to the boss. I mean, you've got to have it. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I love you. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Come on. Subscribe. All coming out every week. Thanks. Thank you.